hello, hello everyone. We are finally, I am back. Um, and we are going back straight into Amnesia. Um, the final day that I had with my family was very much enjoyable. We had, we had flea marking, we spent some time together. But that was the reason why there was no Monday stream. But we are back with Amnesia. We're going to see how far we can get to today. Hope everyone is doing well. Where we last left off, we finished the storage area, and we were needing to get the next parts in the guest room. Can't remember how to play the game, Chad. It's been a while. Okay, leading. Got it. X's for that. Ah, that's right. All right, cool. That's the guest room and the study. All right, so that is. We're on the level through the study. So we need to get to the study. Uh, Sir William Smith has been marked. There was no way for him to know that the young man the other day cast a terrible shadow. Dun, dun, dun. Hope everyone's doing well. We're back in where our resident, uh, with our resident spooky game right now. All right. There's nothing left. Everything's gone. I heard something, Chet. I don't know if you did as well, but there's some resident spooky noises happening. Every everyone has left. All right. All right. We have some cuts and bruises, and our sanity could be better. We need two more. We need four phase Trinity Stream Rod. We need one more of these rods. We got 12 tinder boxes, too. Sure. Oh. Never saw that oil originally. Nearly missed some oil. It's like one of these. Just so we have a little bit of light. There we go. Shut that back. Chambers of a human skull. Ooh, fun. Sure. Flame Retardant Book. Good to know. Is there anything in here? Nope. Do a really quick check once again. Get a few bones out of the way. Appears to be nothing. Hmm. That poster is freaking out. have another jar. Find another way through the study. Because last time we did break into... I say break in. 
we were able to get around. I'm going to turn this light on. There we go. Just so my sanity doesn't go too, da too far down. Well, that's cute. Um. Yeah, there was my sanity some more. We made explosives last episode, but uh, we got rid of our we got rid of that bottle around the rubble. So there has to be a way to get around it. Let's head back. Let's head back. Hope everyone's doing well. For those who are playing Zedcraft, hope everyone's enjoying Zedcraft. Hmm. Can I even go back? I can. I don't think that's a good idea. I can go back. So it's a guest room again. He flipped to the Book of Monarchs looking for etchings and counted nine different kings from all over Europe had to be pictured with an orb resting in their hand. I don't think there's a passageway in here. Oh, bug thing. Yeah, I don't think there's anything in here. Shirt. Shirt. Oh, I need to repick this key up. Or not. Lantern that's empty. Carpenter's drill. So I still have that drill. Don't scare us too much. Okay, well, currently we're scaring everyone with my ineptitude of trying to figure out the what I need to do. But besides that. I think we're all right right now. I just don't know where to go. There has to be something in here that I'm missing. Nope, can't access that. Anatomy, not anatomy. Don't 
I just like throw something at it? We just threw something at it. Eh. That did nothing. Nothing back there. Nothing back there either. Chat fully. We gotta see something. Strong window. I have no idea, chat. Is anyone there? Keep hearing voices over here. Any books that look out of place? Not really. All right. Just so we're not here forever, I'm gonna do a quick look up before my sanity drops even further down than it actually is. All right. Around the study rubble, uh, amnesia, the dark descent. Oh, my goodness, hold up, chat. I just I just saw what it said in the camp. Oh my goodness! I just threw it at the wrong window. Right idea, wrong window. Muck has grown. Well, at least it's not even lit, lit up in here. Hello, you. When will it be my turn? Have I not shown restraint? My patience spans centuries. From where I came, mankind has not even wasted a breath, yet I bow to you. I have done so much to you, I have gained nothing in return. Agrippa, I trust you. If it was I who, in all fairness, should have entered that gate. Hmm. Oh, I did have oil. Yeah. Ooh. If the oil breaks down again, make sure to use the steam engine to build up pressure before channeling into the machine. Adjust the levers to get the right amount of pressure inside the chamber. The meter should read up 8 and down 8. Make sure the flow is set according to the flow chart. Trinity steam set functions. Four phase amplitude. Complete steam flow cycle. And the machine will now check proper configurations until all rods are inserted. Alright. Nothing in here. Alright, before we go insane, let's grab this. Make our way back. A tree fell. See anything freaky in there? I don't. Alright, let's go. Alright, we got it. Yeah, go figure. I threw the, the thing at the wrong window. So we're going to Smith. Okay, yeah. Uh-oh. 
This room is beginning to lose its lusters, chat. You. Well. Well then. Let's try not to touch the goop. Back into this. Machine room. Proof sure was the second death caused by this damn curiosity. How's my sanity? That sucks doing really well. Alright. So I should read up eight and down eight. Hmm. So it's five, six, seven, eight. Yep. One of those done. Next one is this. You know what? I think I got lucky on putting all the rods in. Voices again, chat. <sighs> All right. Boards in place. There we go. Ooh, we got some goop again. Ow! Apparently, I was just walking. Goops keep appearing. Doesn't seem fair, chat. The goops keep appearing. There we go. Kind of how he trying to best to keep himself from screaming. The medicine cabinet had been overturned in the late cups before he reached to the broken glass, grabbed all the sedatives he could find. I can't go back the way I came. I can't go to my nice little safe room again. Here we go. Here we go, champ. We are out of that room and now we're down the elevator. And my sanity and such. Few cuts, bruises, and slight headaches. So I'm saying he's pretty good, considering. Good God. Dark towers of Brennenberg rose above the forest from Marcilla against the snow white moon. We couldn't help feeling sad for some reason. Achievement! Descendant. Taking a left ride on the elevator and amnesia the dark descent. If you heard the achievement twice, that was because uh, my computer also popped it up. We're not in here. This way. Blood. Forgive me, I should have 
warned you. One of my responsibilities as a baron is that of a prison warden. This is where criminals are locked up. Like a dungeon? Very much so. Come, don't linger. Well, this is not good. A place for criminals? This out of the way. And move this out of the way. I really don't like that we're hearing screams already. The game probably just saved. We're probably pretty good. Don't know what that was, but that doesn't sound good. Doesn't sound friendly. Nope. Head's pounding, my heads are shaking. Really? Okay. Area cells one. These that look nice. Sadly, there's no oil, so we kind of have to like like slowly have it on, but then turn things on. Well, that blood doesn't look good. Oh, a hammer. Hey, oil. Perfect. Here we go, got some oil now. I saw a person go that way, so I'm going to go the other way. Oh, well, my sanity, that dropped, that jumped me a bit. Sanity is not doing well. There he goes. Let's see if we can open this door. You know what? All right, we gotta go face towards the monster. All right. I'm insane, but I do have laudanum, so I can heal. Ooh, nice. 
Where is she? Where did she go? No. Oh, tell. I'll never tell you. Ooh. You're just making things worse. Look, this is no place for a young girl all by herself. She could be hurt or worse. There's no telling what horrors await down there. All right. A chipper. So how do they want us to do this? Do we want us to chip the door? Explore chat. I it was actually restored since I figured out the chipper thing. Down, or try to make our way back to the other cell that was locked. <sighs> Let's do a chat. Turned off all my. He turned off all my torches, Jet. Wait for him to go away. It takes about two hits for them to kill me, so I know I'm safe there.
Alright, this may be a bad idea, but let's... Oh, I can't... Oh, I can't go that way at all, chat. Fun. Monsters, but we're gonna make our way to the northern block cell, I guess. Uh, oh, wait. There we go. Look at that, I already had everything. I thought that was my way forward. Apparently not. Down is the way forward. Carefully train the unknown land. Oh. Well, this is horrifying. I don't like this at all. Dead end. Oh, I still have my tools, though. Nope. I got my tools, at least. Septicarium. Uh, what's over here? By the way, there's no monsters, so I'm going to explore. Ooh, this looks promising. Oil, perfect. Noted. Acid. Oh yeah, I'm queen quite badly. All right, cool. There is laudum, so we'll take a laudum. Nice. Oh, some turn boxes. That gives us uh, seven. It's nice. We got fire. I should stop touching stuff. And we have a note. 2nd of August, 1839. I have arrived at the village of Altstadt. It's a haven in the midst of a vast forest and the last stop before my final destination, Castle Brennenburg. It's late in the evening and the outrider, who has been with the coach since Bremen, advised me to wait until morning before I venture further. I've arranged for a bed at Der Müller, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. I try to sleep, but as I close my eyes, I see the men who fell victim in London. My fear and shame forces me to witness the same scenes over and over. They are dead because of me. Mm. So Daniel's a bit guilt ridden. Got it. Up. Oh. 
Bye, big chat. Time for us to run again. Oh my god! You're much faster than I anticipated. Chat, we may die here. Bleeding quite profusely. I am what you would call wounded. It needs to be weakened further. All right. So I need to get a jar of acid. Hey, you! Stop! Don't come any closer. I just want to leave. You can't go outside. It's too dangerous. I doubt that very much. I'm also, oh, I was about to say I'm running out of oil, but. Be safe? Well, it's for his own good. Soon it will be ready. Let there be enough time. Alright, there we go. We're moving again. here and see what happens. See what happens. Keep running. God, he's so fast. Well, Chet, I am incredibly injured. Oh, I don't like the body. Got a note here. Third of August, eighteen thirty-nine. I feel like I have fled the world and all its worries. Brennenberg is a majestic creation, perched upon a forest-clad hill with towers reaching well above even the highest pine trees. Following the winding road leading to the gates gives the impression of discovering something forgotten, as if journeying with Marco Polo to the hidden Xanadu. Alexander, the Baron, is a peculiar but gracious man. He seems well versed in worldly matters and is not at all as eccentric as I assumed. My room is exquisite, and I'm confident I'm that no that. hotel for miles yeah, he's good, very good at seeking. to match it. As the sun sets on Brennenberg, its fairy tale varnish turns to an eerie gloom. Alexander's strange servants are never far away. They are a quiet lot, and their behavior could only be described as skulking. Alexander seems pleased by my presence. As he puts it, 
It seems like I got here just in time. Well, that's not foreboding at all. All right, chat, we are. We're gonna die anyway, so we can at least start trying to explore. Man, he keeps finding me. That's horrifying. this way. And I do mean literally walk. It won't budge, huh? Let's try this thing. Excellent condition walk. Cool. Cardinia, which I believe is where we were just been. So I'm looking for a flask of some sort. Fill this up with acid. Ah. Nope. I'm about to die. place to hide next time I'll be here if I die. Back down we go. Of course we gotta explore with a weird goat with a weird monster just around. Never easy. Hey! 
haven't checked in here yet. 4th of August, 1839. The nightmares woke me in the early morning, and for a moment I forgot where I was. Shortly after, there was a knock on my door. Alexander had heard my screams and asked me to join him in the parlor. As we drank our tea, Alexander began to tell me what he knew. It seems like the orb I found casts a long and dark shadow. It's not only a powerful item, but a dangerous one. Simply by touching it, you invoke the powers within, and if you are too weak to control it, it will devour you. The shadow is a sluggish thing, lagging behind the wielder, killing anyone or anything in its path to reclaim the orb. I said I didn't care about its powers, and that I should throw it away. Alexander advised against this, as I'd still be a part of the path to the orb, and eventually suffer death. Having the orb, I would at least have the chance to fight back when the time came. I asked Alexander what he meant when he said he could protect me, and he answered that things can be done, but at a price. At a price, huh? That is the wrong door. My sanity is... Oh, a few cracks and bruises, so I'm healing. So there's a natural healing factor to the bruises at least. He's stuck on something. Uh, I have to move on. Oh, by the way, chat, for those who are wondering, I'm not going for every ending. Glass jar. I just want to beat the game. It's saying I did. Because I am spooked. So guess what, chat? I gotta run by the monster again. Say hi to Fred. Bye, Fred. Don't see him, at least. And hopefully, with me dipping this, no, I've read yet. With putting this glass thing in there, hopefully, I am praying, I regain some of my sanity. Yes. Alright.
do no good. All right. All right, chat, we need to make our way all the way back to that broken lock. So expect monsters. And plenty of them. I highly doubt the game's gonna let us get there free of charge. to the cistern. Company said, keep it covered all the time. Yeah, I'd rather call off the orb. I just reached out, picked it up, hug it, it's light, cover it, and said, keep it covered at all times. Alright. Somewhere different. So, you used the drain sewers as a means of transport? Yes, they were built to divert water from an underground spring and are quite spacious. It seemed only natural to incorporate it into the overall structure. But we won't be using it. Not today. The flow is seasonal, and when the spring runs dry, the damp tunnels produce a rather poisonous type of fungi. There is an antidote, of course, but we won't be bothering with it today. Come, this way instead. We're almost there. Well, I'm not a fan of that. Won't budge. Also, chat, since it's a cistern, take a while, I'd guess we're about to meet again. here. I guess I need to get up there. Gears need to be greased. I do not want to go back to that area already. There's a ladder chat. I need a vessel to carry oil. Oh. the machine power on the eastern bridge. Oh. I can't get over there, but I can go over here. Sister. <sighs> you know what? I would like it if we decided to just take a break from the monsters that could chase me. Because at least I know if I have an idea of what's monsters in here. You can serve water from the spring. 
Yes, it enables me to control the water in the drain sewers to some extent. Also, it can be used for all sorts of purposes. Like for drinking? Yeah, well, that too. But mostly to run different machines. Ah, like water mill. Exactly. So, well, I can't go that way. Fun. Chat. There's water. Take a wild guess whose friend is back. Hey, dinner box. Perfect. At least it's nice and lit up somewhat in here. Nice change of pace. All right, cool. Parkour. Ooh. Well, into your boxes. Look at that shit. The game is being nice to me. No denying that Alexander puts a lot of faith into what I can only describe as magic. I'm not surprised. Even while traveling across Europe, I assumed I would have to embrace the supernatural to save my mind and life. As a novice, I do everything in my power to stay focused and not dwell too much on my own doubts. Alexander woke me up early and told me it was time we got started on our work. He was obviously excited to get going and we headed downstairs to the old dungeon where he preferred to attempt his rituals. It turns out that Alexander is a true Renaissance man, paralleled only by da Vinci, I'm sure. He showed me several rooms fitted for specific research, such as anatomy studies, alchemy, and botany. The crown of Brennenburg must be the inner sanctum, a most hallowed ground where we shall attempt to permanently banish the orb's shadow. Interesting. We direct sewer water. Yep. Doing good on my sanity, it's just waving. All right. Don't trust this water. It's very hard to throw water, so I don't trust it. There's a rock there, good to know. Few rocks over there. Few rocks around. Good to know. I have a theory. All right, let's see if I can do this. Jet. See if this works. It did. I'm amazed it worked. Oh, that thing is gonna break as soon as we get in there, chat. I know it. 8th August, 1839. I could never be certain until today that I was on the right path. Using my orb, 
Alexander managed to channel its power unto us. The inner sanctum flared with blue, fiery light, and I could feel the same things I felt in the dark chamber in Algeria. It was like standing in a mad whirlpool of impressions. It was terrifying. But Alexander kept calm and wielded strange tools of science in order to tame the storm. Suddenly, the blue light was stained by strains of red, and the walls burst with pulsating tissue resonating with the scene. Alexander quickly covered the orb in some cloth, and the unspeakable thing vanished. Apparently, the orb's shadow is closer than Alexander thought. He said I should prepare for a warding ritual tomorrow. I'm not sure what he expects, but I have a bad feeling about this. Ooh, a bad feeling, chat. Here we go. Oh my god, chat, it did not break. I'm amazed. I thought for sure that that, that would break. All right. Oh, hey, look. A little bit of light, at least. Calm our nerves at least a little bit. Something happened, chat. I heard something. Maybe not. Let's go. Oh, look, a puzzle. Ow. I was quick. Turn that off. Turn that steam off. Ooh, that's fun. Hey. Well, I'm out of oil. Well, no, I got a little bit more oil. Put that in. 9th of August, 1839. It is still early and Alexander is busy preparing for the ritual later today. Seeing him this worked up makes me question why. What does he stand to gain? I realize he is curious about it all, but surely there must be more. Is he so foolish he will attempt to tame the power of the orb? I must admit that yesterday, when Alexander flooded the inner sanctum with blue light, I realized we had but graced the orb's true potential. This might turn out to be more than escaping a creeping shadow. It might be the beginning of something truly extraordinary. Ooh. Spooky. There we go. Treatment! Pipe worker. More than the water level. I guess I'll try to run across. Hmm. I guess the water's fine now, Chet. Nothing chased me in the water. The red taint burst through walls to begin to bleed. He cried out of fear as the spectacle began to consume the blue shimmer. Is this one fixed yet or no? No. 
So we need to head down. I think they want me to go over here. Yeah, this has been tra drained. Hi, Chad. All right. Find a vaccine to face with traverse the sewers. All right. Ow. All right, Chad. I'm going to be you. Real quick, we're going to take a very quick break. Uh, I need to use the restroom real quick. Um, but just a quick break, and I'll be hello, hello. We are back. Back in Amnesia. Door to budge. I haven't tried opening this door. Oh, I can open it. I knew there must be a way to finish the ritual before it was too late. He had to teach his friend to harvest the Vita. That was much to that much was certain. Alright. So we're in here now. Oh, I am out of oil. That is a pipe. I don't know I can pick up. Yeah, let's at least light one of these. There we go. Nope. Can't open it. Got it. We got some more pipes. Missing any pipes, or are these just useless? Possibly useless. There we go. Stuck in this position. Stuck in this position. All right, so they're stuck in this positions. Is that done now? Is that what they all said about prepare the left one? I was just with Trish Saint being able to grow inside Brandenburg. Alas, it was Alexander's studies and not care which enabled put the flower to blossom. Nope. Right. That didn't work. we go. Uh, say so the orbs found a way to force them to yield their power. However, he was still unaware of this. Hmm. These doors shut themselves again. Let's raise each of these up again.
Hmm. Do I have to try to get the ones over here looking like this? The so one here is just above that layer, that thing. So it's there, I believe. The one in the back is just over the back pipes. We're trying to see if we can. like that and that one was just under that one This looks dangerous, but at the same point, I think we're going the right way. Let's see if we can be smart. Look at that chat, I'm smart. Kept the walks so we can get in and out. What is this? Alright, that didn't work. Um a wooden crank. Alright. Yeah, let us get one up here. I like getting lights where I'm going to be standing at least. Yeah, I'm out of oil though. Which sucks. We have room like this as well. Ooh, nope. Machine. The work I have put into the machine is unequaled by the reasoning of any man. The thought that generations of men have passed away since I first attempted to reconstruct the design is most tiring. The limitations of this world have made my work incredibly difficult. It has forced me to build the thing almost a hundred times larger than the delicate contraption it tries to emulate. Not to mention the flow of tamed lightning cruelly, crudely replaced the, by pressured steam pushing its way through the pipes and turbines. It shames me to think that what the inventor would have thought of my monster. Where he works with a magnifying glass to carefully fix all the parts, I push five men to erect a tower of wrought iron in the hope it will even the tiniest hint of power found in the traveler's locket. So he's trying to create power, very literally. Ooh, chat, yeah, look. Oil. Drink. I can't get out. Alright, so we got more levers over here. Oh, these levers are actually done something. So two down, two, all right. When I gather, it's time for mimicking. So let's see if we can do it. So these two are down. Okay. trying to do all right so they're stuck in those positions real quick can I open this door oh I can't hello
It's a very empty room. Like, suspiciously empty. The point that I think I'm meant to hide here. So, if we're gonna hide here, let's give a place to hide. Oh, I just slammed that door. To your reduce like this. We're playing building blocks, Jack. Congrats. We're playing Minecraft. We're playing a block game. See? There we go, Jet. We got a hiding space now. We can hide behind here. Oh, wait. No, it'd be better if we hide on this side, though. There's a candle. Sorry, Chet. I am preparing. Cause I already know those monsters are going to be. It's probably monsters are going to be afoot anytime because. You know what? Everything is just too calm. There we go. Now we got a better hiding space with light. Uh, just in case. We have a dark spot too. Alright. So this needs to be fully down somehow. Oh, there you go. Actually, talk to. Hmm. Uh, actually, actually, talk to us for once. I really blinded him as it's done inside the murky tomb in Drea. It was just an enchanting, and he tried to approach it, but the Baron's firm hand held him back. Then what did I do? In the control room, what did I accomplish then? around see what I need to accomplish those are still works that still works those are stuck He should be stuck. Yeah, they're stuck in position now. So what are we missing? All the copper pipes leave into here. Oh, all right, I get it now. They moved. They moved. My, they messed up my room, chat. They didn't allow me to keep my things. All right. So we do need these. I am so happy I decided to put these boxes down. Do any pipes in here? No. There was a pipe in here, I believe. Yeah. Shutting doors, but with the stuff. There you go. There we go. So we 
need to like connect everything. Pipes. Alright, there we go. We're looking for more pipes. Use the oil just so we can see a little bit. Oh, there we go, that's a pipe. Probably a pipe in the other room, too. Oh, this should increase my sanity, though. Even though I think we're pretty good on sanity. Final piece. You in here? I haven't really checked in here for a pipe. Granted, I may have gotten that other pipe from here. Yeah, let me check the other room. Can't remember where I got the pipe from. I could have gotten the pipe from that room. Anything hidden? Oh, all right. We're looking for pipes. We're a plumber now. We are now Mario. All right. Trying to be quick and efficient with my oil. Has to be another pipe somewhere in this room. Sure, we're Mario now. Yeah, exactly. See, Mel gets it. We're Mario. Uh, hmm. a pipe. And I can't take it off the wall. Let's see it. We know what's in this area because we can't like move big objects between rooms. Has to be somewhere in here. We're just—I just haven't found it yet. Uh, let's see. Where is it? We got scour rooms now for pipes. Nothing in here. Probably should stop using oil. Because I'm only now just like, I know there's no monsters in here. And it's kind of a straight, <coughs> excuse me. And it's kind of a straight shot to get around, so. 
Why waste the oil? I'm just happy that we actually got like response from Alexander. So Alexander knows we're here. Now at least. He's just confused. He doesn't know what we're doing. Do you work now? Yeah, he does. We need to push to dislodge it. Oh, okay. So I need to throw something at it, huh? Sounds like fun. Sure, I'll throw something at it. Well, that didn't work. Let's just go up. We threw a rock up here so we can try to throw it again. There's a rock. There we go. Ah, the morgue. Sounds like fun. Sounds like the grandest place to be, the morgue. I don't like how... Okay. Do you see, Daniel? It has yielded. What? The shadow has for now. Come, let's get this out of here so we can get some peace. Yes, let's. Where to? Just down the corridor to the morgue. Are there more dead men there? You did well, Daniel. Come, let's get going. Yep. What? What happened? Why are all these dead? Where am I? What's happening? Okay. Help! Anybody? Help! Lana. There's a few dead guys here. Someone wasn't having a good time. That you can hear me breathing is really unsettling. Or a lot of them chat. Some tinder boxes. Ooh, one of these things. 
I fear for Daniel, for he is reckless. He is tainted by the approaching shadow and will not be able to pass the gate. But he will be able to accept us in the end. My love, I've seen evil in him. How do I trust him with the truth? What cruel iron I have to do to unto him what Agrippa did unto me. Hmm. The vaccine enabling many men to work in the fungal ridden sewer is a definite success. Unfortunately, only a few of the servants have been remedied as the procedure proved difficult. The others will perish, and eventually I will have to create more of them to keep, keep my experiments running. Note that an injection of vaccinated blood will work as a shield long enough to pass through it without any risk of infection. It will do fine for prisoner transport. Alright. Ooh, another note. You're in the box, dude. The strange deaths among the servants and the prisoners have finally been resolved. It seems that the drain sewer, which has recently been opened up for the use as means of transport, is plagued by a peculiar poisonous fungi. The victims seem to have suffered an extremely quick outbreak of sickness affecting the entire body. Some of my men, including myself, are blissfully spared by this calamity, but it's clear that it, this cripples my progress. The prisoners die quickly, and the contaminated vitality lacks the energy I seek. I shall immediately start working on a vaccine. Alright. I'm going to take a guess. The opening is these doors where the blood is. It's a bad thing. The answer is yes. What's over here? Also, I'm going to guess it's, this is not doing my sanity any favors by staring at it. What are we doing? It's only a day old, huh? The. Oh, wait. Uh. Oh, penetrate the skull. Ooh. That's not good. Oh, cool. I give myself a vaccine. Three. I gave myself a vaccine. So what now? Uh, not going that way. Hiding my hair in here. Oh, I bet my sanity is doing so well staring at the bodies. Just walked away, chat. I'm on. I'm in a few cuts and bruises. So I think I can take one single hit if necessary. Oh, it's hard to see though. There we go. Ugh. Well, I'm now mentally insane, once again.
head this way just to see. Oh, and yeah, I have no more oil. But I'm safe at least now. From the, from the poison at least. Hey, we're in the sewer now. Henry Bedlo went to class carrying the anger of his brother and mother. He never cried. He made others cry instead. Pain is like that. You either become sad or you become angry. Henry always chose the latter. Hmm. Ooh. Hey, my sanity went better. Oh, this doesn't look fun. I don't like this at all. Alright, so we got a wandering monster. It's really helping we get a break from that. Head this way. Oh, this just looks like a fun place to run around in. Why is that? Why is this gate busted? that way sadly. Or mushrooms. Hey! Door. Ooh. A full refill. Perfect. fan. I have to try to figure out how to get around Fred if necessary. Hey, we're in the sewers now. We're really a plumber now. I do feel like I'm about to do lots and lots of running though. Pipe seems to be loose, huh? Pipe. 
the heck am I supposed to do with this? I do like that it's not totally dark in here, at least. There's a little bit of light going around. I mean, I guess that's daylight above us. We need to slow it down, huh? Does that slow it down? Let's see. Time being, yes. I believe I did something right, chat. I don't think a monster would have spawned if I didn't do anything right. Did my basic physics actually come in handy? So the idea was small gear uh, rotating big gear means you need it would slow down considerably. Look at that, chat. Yeah, we're here. We're on this side now. Those pipes look like they could break. Fun looking room. Logan, though. Daniel, turn around this instant. You are carrying the shadow with you. So I can't go this way. So where do I go then? A barred gate was torn down by that creature. Oh, hi! <laughs> that scared me. Whew. Hi, you. He was able to kill me in one shot.
that's not good. Hey, you. We're gonna just hide here and see what happens. A few cuts and bruises. If we die, we die. I'm just gonna run. I can't go that way. Doesn't seem fair. He's blocking the entrance. running worth it? No clue, Jack, but we're gonna try. Mm. Where's running, Jack? Ooh. Ooh, spooky. things roaring at me. There's never any escape. Things like this live with you always. How could he know if Henry would, sh would show up down the road or even at his house? Is he that mad? Would he do that? Oh. Hey. Don't want much. We got back here. Tinder boxes, levers, and a note. 9th of August, 1839. I can't stop sweating and shaking. The warding ritual was not something of a sane mind. I did not even realize the dungeon was still in use. Alexander had his servants bring one of the prisoners, a murderer, he told me. Hmm. Alexander made all 9th of August, 1839. I can't stop sweating and shaking. Effect. The warding ritual was the not something of a sane mind. By the blood of another. I did not even realize the dungeon was still in use. Alexander had his servants bring one of the prisoners. What else oh. could I do? Alexander said it had to be done. He is saving my life. I don't have the luxury of argument. I could barely hear that chat. Did you hear that chat out of curiosity? Let me know if you did or didn't. If you didn't, I'll read it out loud. But I could barely hear that. You able to hear it? Okay, cool. That 
alley somewhere. This door is open. This leads nowhere, but the center box. That's always nice. I I just say where I got I like my heart's been beaten since, like the monsters. All right, so that's an option. There we go. Got a lot of tender boxes though. Which we will be using. Ooh. All right, sure, we'll go down the spooky staircase. Yeah, I think we're getting close to the end of the game. Oh, yeah, I got a torch. Ooh, tender box. Thank you. What else do we got? It doesn't look like anything. Oh, no, more tender box. More tender boxes. Got so many tinder boxes. Agrippa, Ooh. I need you to stay awake. Can you feel the syringe? No, I can't feel anything. Alexander? Yes. Soon, I won't even be able to move, will I? Your life is safe. I don't doubt that. But will it be worth living? Ooh. Oh, someone's down there. Hello? Hi. Help me. Pull the switch. Pull the switch. Oh. You don't look good. My name is Agrippa. Who might you be? Daniel? Like the prophet thrown into the lion's den? <laughs> Tell me, are you among the giants? Guess I'm not hearing it since I have the wrong ear button, apparently. Alexander? Oh, my. So the Babylon shall fall, you say. <laughs> you hurry too much. Yeah, Alexander there you go. is toothless without an all. Very promising role. The sector is basically a benefit, but I guess in my mind. Okay. It could be reached by another, but Alexander broke his, I mean, my own, a long time ago. Really? Well, if you tell the truth, by all means, seek out the pieces of the broken wall and mend away. I believe he uses them for torture now. They practically leave madness. Which is quite useful, I understand. There should be six of them. Look around the fire and the transom. You should be able to find them there. All right. An orb is needed to enter the inner sanctum. Its shattered pieces lie scattered in the tortured rooms. All right. Take that away. I hate to bother you further, but if you're really going after Alexander, would you consider? Taking me with you? I know it sounds ridiculous. I mean, look at him. But if you find anything concerning a man named Johann Heim, would you please bring it to me? I believe he was working on a way to help him. A recipe for some sort of potion, a tonic to free me from this husk of mine. Ooh. A grip of the diamonds is a note written by the man named Johann Weyer. All right. Who me? I'm Heinrich Cornelius Agrippi. Heinrich. Quite important to you. Baron Alexander has sustained my soul in this dead husk for years. 
Who knows how many? Hundreds, I presume. Hmm. Alexander is quite impressive in many ways, but he has grown impatient. I like this old man. He's creepy, yeah, but I like him. So. Cannot be open from here. A heavy door is blocking the path? Let me guess. Heavy door blocking the path? Yep. So we're trying to figure out, find a thing from Johan Weya. There we go. Ooh, another tin box. Ooh, that's a insanity room. No monster. That's uh, what's what's this door? This is to the ch uh chancel well, these look like fun places to stay overnight look at all that spacious room I'm getting a feeling we're pretty closely at this game Ghosts, apparently. Ooh, hello. Tinder box. He's got all the tinder boxes, chat. I know this. I've been here already. I know this taste. The taste of the Damascus Rose obfuscating the truth in a dim age. They may sweep the traces from my memory, but my body oh, remembers. These cuts speak volumes, even though my mind remains silent. They will be back. Oh, they will be back. Doesn't seem nice. Let's see. Anything in here? No. I picked up meat. Must be something else. By me, I'm the next best thing. Alexander really bugged it. None of us is Johann Bayer. What the hell was the screaming? You never heard of Johann Bayer? My God. He's probably the greatest man in history, and you don't know him? Or is it the world who has forgotten him? Remember to hydrate everyone. I was my pupil. My pupil. Oh, okay. Yes, I do take pride in that matter. Is it so wrong? See why they gave me so many of these things Who are you to question me? So I got a piece of meat though, chat. Let's go to the chancel. It has gone too far. The man was suffocating as he could no longer breathe deeply properly between the lashes to please start to look for the Damascus Rose oil. Just a little further. It's like Orpheus descending into the underworld. 
Are you hiding something? What do you mean? Never mind. Your intuition is remarkable. I'm not sure I'm following. It doesn't matter. It's just a myth after all. So I have a feeling forward is where we need to go. Don't want to go forward. We're looking for the choir and the transept. Ooh. 12th of August, 1839. Banishment ritual is taking longer than expected, and we have to do what is needed. I spend my time helping out the prisoners. Being around these degenerates makes me ill. None of them even tries to face their punishment with any kind of dignity. They taunt me with their lies of innocence and their cowardly pleas of mercy. What can make a man fall so far from the grace of a civilized existence? They are all wicked men, and I remind myself of it constantly. Still, I am thankful for God sending these monsters our way, as they will serve as the instruments of my salvation. I try to study the different tools in the torture chamber and learn how to use them effectively. Last time was messy, and the effect suffered from my inexperience. When the next warding is to be performed, I shall be ready. Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. Hey, you got the tar. That's what I one thing I need. Uh, those people were not innocent. <laughs> but no, they were innocent. They weren't guilty. They were innocent. Ooh, hello. That, it won't budge. Come on. Fine. Walk way back up. What is this? When you need any of these? No, I. This is the direction I need to go to beat the game. It would make the most sense. Yeah, I need an orb to enter. So yeah, that's where I need to go. I can't go that way because there's a. I need a ball. I need the orb. I'm also looking for notes from John Weyer, because you know what, the spooky guy in there, well, you know what, he helped me, so you know what, I want to help him. He seems friendly enough. I should be able to help him. Shut the door. All is lost, I must start, must once again start over. Ever since I recovered the orb first found in Agrippa, I have depended on it my research. The incident that Wilhelm made me most imperatus, fearing paucity of prisoners, I proceeded with the final ritual without proper foresight. The orb cracked and fell into six parts. I have tried everything, but I have yet to mend the thing. Unless I can think of a way to piece it together, I will have to find another. There is still life in the pieces, and even if the orb isn't restored, it might be able to salvage some of its power for some other purpose. Centuries have passed in vain. I begin to wonder if I will ever be able to see my love again. How much longer can I sustain my life? Ew. Oh, we're saying Mesopotamia texts and everything like that. This dude may be really old. Oh yeah, this dude is old. What's in here? Okay. This may be where I piece the oars back together. But I still need the pieces, so I'll possibly need to head back. No idea. Is this the old time of missing ten? If so, blame yourself. You started this. You sent me that letter asking for help, and this 
is how you repay me. How dare you? Yeah, 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 yeah. Head back down. The nave. Such so filthy thought. Good men can safely cheer their departure as they are nothing but a burden to mankind. They shall not be missed. Uh, we really thought those prisoners were bad people. Not that not. These cells are mental prisoners who are under treatment. The people you send for will end up here. Remember that the confinement itself works as a preamble to the torture, and you should peace yourself. Don't take anyone before they are ready. Understood. Sounds from the torture chambers are shuttled in through those pipes in the ceiling. Manage your victims well and let one prisoner's pain instill terror in his cellmate. All right. Back to the world? Cool. You know. Can I use the saw to like break through the wood boards? I need to get in there. I still have you. Cannot use in the way. Let's use one of these. Nope. I have a piece of meat. I have no idea what I'm going to do with it, but I have a piece of meat. Head back up. I've been in here, yes. All right. I came from the well. That door won't budge. I went down that way. And I think I went down here, but I didn't go far. All right, Mementos. Two levers of the top floor are not working. It's probably some problem with machinery. Machinery, huh? Touch that. All right. Time to be plumbers again. So yeah, let's use a few. So I need to figure out how to get into there. Uh, maybe a rock? Grab a rock. Maybe a box. Can we use a box to to break the thing? Nope, those are some sturdy wood. We've gotta be missing some things. Good to see. Yeah. What level? Oh that So many of Alexander's things are breaking down. Look around. Maybe the other room. Woo. You'll find a way to fix it. I like this guy. Open. 
Now we gotta do each room. Nope, nothing in here. Nothing. Nothing. Uh, yeah, light you up. Light a few of these up. Because I have a sense we'll be back in here a few times. Ooh, hello. Yo, dude, do you know how to open this door? Dad, good to see you. I found the meat fire plants. Land which had not been planted. Do you know meat fire, is it? Well, I suppose it doesn't matter. It is an old baby building temples out of caverns. The dark walls being the universe. And inside are its followers. Humans watching the sky slowly tire. But the followers do have one thing to allow them a real sense of connection. Creation. The forms. Okay. head back to the uh the uh, they said the other room so let's try here and then we'll head back to the like, very beginning i do not want to go back downstairs we haven't had to backtrack yet in this game Monster is gone at least. That's nice. I haven't seen the monster at all. Let's see. So yes, chat. Currently, I am lost, so if you're wondering, yes. Let's see. Excellent. Let's head all the way back up.
Hmm. Well, is and isn't. I'm just happy to have someone to talk to, to be honest. Like, I'm happy that we got someone to like listen to, and he'll spat off some things to help us out, or try to at least. He's doing his best. Budge, and this is the machine room. Let's see. Those aren't working. All right. We have tried the other room. I'm worried that I'm missing just a door that I can't open. I haven't been able to open that door yet. Hey, Grip, I'm back. How are things coming? Uh, slowly. Saying it could be better, but it's working. Where is it? The other door I haven't checked in a while is that back one. So let's head back there. See if I missed anything back there. Check back with the when we get back the one on our left. And then, oh. well, hello. Pass us move finister depression on top. Yeah. Oh. To fit and orb. I'm not even going to attempt it, chat. That looks like it hurts. The entire thing over there looks like it hurts. Let's go back over here, do a quick check to see if we missed anything. Look it up real quick. I'll move myself so I'm closer to that. Amnesia. Uh, let's see. Dark 
Descent Agrippa Doors. Okay. Yep. Wait, what? All right, Jet. I have a direction to at least go with. That's my big thing. I'm always just looking for a quick direction and then I'll start pondering again. Uh, yeah, this way. To the big gates. I don't want to spend all the time here, and I know we're so close to beating the game. I really want to see if we can push for it. I hope and shush me. Oh, chat, to let you guys know, uh, I'm going to tell you again Friday. Uh, this is my last Monday, Wednesday, Friday week. I'll be moving over to a Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday schedule due to upcoming... Uh, uh, college. So I'll be moving over to Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. And the times may be varied. They may not. Ah, you would get it. I've always hoped fire would return and give me a second chance. But so does not exist. That's why he keeps me here as a hostage, hoping fire will reveal himself. So yeah, chat. I didn't see this. Hey dude, next time you need And I appreciate your But I believe you have more than we go. There we go. So yeah, there was a trap tour over that table. I would never have guessed. Now we go all the way up. There we go. It's a long way up. It's this one? Yeah. Now we can pull these up. Hey, Sandy back. When you get sanity, it means progress has been made. Daniel, you have gone too far. I have to stop you. I can't let you proceed any further. I'm sorry, my friend. River. River down. River got on top of my desk. I don't allow him on my desk. Hey, Agrippa. Was there something else? Uh, Alexander's angry at me. Good going. I knew you could do it. It's down here first. Ooh, hello. Shut that door. Tender box. Nope. Where taunts me on the other side. I trust him with my true reason of my efforts and still he insists on releasing Agrippa. How an enlightened man can show such lack of compassion and see the power disgusts me. I can't bring myself to part from Agrippa as he and has been for centuries my only late to the world beyond. Where claims he tries his best to release me and my banishment and he knows needs me to give him Agrippa first so he can help. Two can help. If he can guarantee this, I would happily oblige, but how am I to part from him if my return might be denied? I know what they are capable of. I have seen their deception. Optimism is the most hopeless feeling, but I must retain it. I shall prepare for his release. 
To release Agrippa without killing him, Ware told me to feed him a tonic made from Paralyza, Vita, and Tempter. The poisonous fungi should work as a paralyzer, if I should find the internal gland from a larger specimen. The choir seems to be a fertile gland for this sort. I should be then able to extract its contents with the proper tools. The vitae should be extracted as usual from any agonized human victim's blood. If I need large amounts to distill it proper, remember to click this during the next torture session. Tamter, on the other hand, will prove more difficult. I don't think it exists in this world. Simply writing the word with these letters looks wrong. I believe it's property of the secretion and the water-dwelling Karnik. I'll have to address Weyer with this, as he'll have to supply me with a host. Also, a properly prepared well should suffice to contain it. Okay. A group that I seek is a note written by you. Uh, let's see. A mixture of three ingredients. Yep. This area is pretty dark, and I got a decent amount. So what is this? This is the choir entrance. All right. Before I do anything, I want to check all of these. So this is how I get Tamter. And yeah, this is transept. Sure, let's go to the transept first. So I need to get Tamter. So I need to get six pieces of the orb, Tamter, Kanek. I know, Tamter's from the clinic, and then there's the fungus, and there's one other object. Oh, uh, someone's tortured blood. This doesn't look fun. How much more, Baron? How much more am I supposed to withstand? Kill me, your man! Kill me! This one, prepare you. All right. in here first. Well, this looks fun. Ooh. Flashback. The kidnapper sat at her knees with her hands tied behind her back. She felt her hands being lifted and her volley followed. Her shoulders gave way to the weight of her own body and cracked loudly. The spindle would cry hysterically as the men con contemplated the next step. Well, that's not fun. That's not fun at all. Hey! Piece of the orc. You got one piece. Fun. I actually know what that one is.
The RNS kept carrying it was slowly lowered on off the paler. It didn't take much to break him. They had meant for him to die, but the torture was working beyond their expectations. It wasn't the method, it was the arsonist. He was different from theirs. They could make him forget again. Ugh. So there's probably three pieces in here and then three pieces in the choir area. Wait, hold up. I ran out of oil, I see. Well, I guess I have to do with this next one bit alone. Chad, I'm going mad. Here we go. Uh, the blank hanged upside down, his tears spoiled with blood flooding with from his belly. They saw between his legs and lodged itself in the hip and wouldn't move any further. The man sat back and waited for the victim to train. Oh, God. Alright. Torture is torture. Torture, no fun. Sure, I'll, walk, I'll walk, run through the dark. Nothing bad happens to me in the dark. Cool. Uh, you know what? I'm curious. We're going upstairs. <laughs> Everyone, what's your thoughts on like the spiral staircase? I'm a big fan. Some string, some oil. What we got? Nothing. Nothing. A note. There are quite a few things to said about torture. I had figured about that the reaction I would get from the victims would be highly individual. Thankfully, that is not the case. The humans are all very similar approach to dealing with the physical pain and terror of anticipation. I cannot stress enough the importance of restraining the victims before proceeding. Even the most timid creature can break out in fits of violence when their strength exceeds their expected prowess. If proper care has been put into the breaking of the victim, this should not be the problem, but also hinder the effect that I am after. The right steps to take are, therefore, to restrain while the victim is still dazed, proceed by presenting the form of torture you're about to apply, and then to continue with the actual act. The point of presentation is to infuse terror. The human mind is extremely efficient, as it will trigger itself into greater fear simply by imagining it. While applying pain, make sure to avoid massive damage so as to prove more efficient if the process can be sustained. Also, apply the pain in doses, if possible with bricks to let the body settle. If you are whipping or cutting the victim, strike once, wait for the pain to subdue, then strike again. As long as the body suffers it, it will continue to produce the vitae and saturated blood with its properties. Only with careful performance will the victim yield maximum effect. If the victim doesn't behave as expected, it is likely that all will will be for naught. Before this happens, feed them the amnesia drink and try it again later. <sighs> the amnesia drink. Another one of these. It is you, my love. I miss the most. Or is it perhaps myself? I know what I have become. I am not blind. I am a monster to them. A demonic Satan perched on a dark mountain top. There is little I can do to redeem myself. The Black Eagles fear me, and after Napoleon's defeat... Ah, oh, dang it, I was defeated now. Uh, it is only a matter of time before they would demand my head on the platter. I must remove myself from this land. This time, it must work. If I can't return home now, I shall perish. Well, dang it, I was defeated already. I thought this was before my defeat. Never mind. Man, I don't... Prussians and their, like, loyalty to their nation and all that. Blah, blah, blah. And yet, I can't... Take over? Come on. I should be allowed to take over. Well, this area was quite nice and, you know, 
simple. We'll be back here for sure. Do I have anything to like? I do have something. Where is he? Hey Chet, a body is missing all of a sudden, I just realized. That's not fun. Head back down here. Okay. There we go. Hey! Got the blood I need. So, I have the blood. I know that sounds bored, but we're actually defeating the game. <laughs> yeah. I've been defeated in game. All right. Uh, notes. Yeah. Yeah. So, we need a fungi, which is in the choir. We have the vitae. We now need temp tempter, which is in the kernerk. Which we now know where that is. The Navi. We're getting somewhere though. So in here. Nothing is fully happening. There you Needs to be pulled up, huh? All right, so then how do I? here we'll come back after we do the choir because maybe the choir will give us some um, another resource we need Good to see. you seem to have found all the orb pieces used in the transept go to the choir and find the rest oh nice Pilot choir cool actually hold up let's check in here real quick I'm checking up here real quick. Alright, choir time. Choir entrance. Carefully cutting the man open made him think this is how father must feel about his craft. Being an artist, relying on one's skill to perform something so delicate grants a certain form of pride. Oh, uh, let's actually fill our thing back up with oil. I 
Uh, the man which could bring the ritual began. Ooh, fun. Oh, there's that. Perfect. I know. 15th of August, 1839. The blood wards are failing. The shadow beckons, and its cry disarms my actions. Hurry. No time to spare. You have to kill another. Alexander produces a knife. He wants me to cut the flesh. Oh, God. Do it. Save yourself. He is a murderer, Daniel. He is evil. A cold-blooded killer. Hurry. Alexander, you must let me be. I have to concentrate. Take the man, cut the lines, cut the flesh, and watch the blood spill. Let it come. Oh, God. Please, I didn't do anything. Paint the man, cut the lines. Paint the man, cut the lines. Please, the man cries. I don't think we're the good guy, chat. Well, one life for another. You hear me, guardian of the orb? I did all this for you. Now, once more, withdraw your shadow from my domain. Oh, I'm terrified, chat. Oh, thank goodness. Alexander. There isn't much time. I can feel it. We must act swiftly. I will do whatever it takes. All right, chat. Uh, we're bad guy. Choir main hall. If fear had begun to drown him again, he reached for once more for the empty bottle of laudanum and frustration, he smashed it against the bedpost. What are my intentions, Daniel? I don't like it here. Salvation. It used to be yours, but now you only seek misplaced revenge. How do you justify your violence? It is for the greater good. Are you doing the world a service? It is you who caused all this pain and death. If you had accepted your fate and submitted to the orb when you first discovered it, none of this would have happened. It is curiosity in league with your selfishness that is killing us it's both. The shadow. It's close now. I don't want to open this, but I may be forced to. God, hi. Oh, why did I touch it? The forger stood still. The cask had been closed by a faint light. It was a myriad of spikes pointed at him, glittering as they waited for his body to slip just a moment. His knee jerk and he felt blood tickle down his leg. In pain, his head felt slightly dead. It took him a while to realize his eye had ruptured and begun to leak. Ooh, wee. Not fun. Gotta be an orb somewhere around here. A bone. I'm about to wander in the darkness, aren't I? I'll check. I got plenty of laudanum, so I can just run past things and just drink and heal. Can't go that way. And some bones. Jet, I have a high suspicion that there's a monster in here. And if I don't see it, or if I see it and I run away, it, uh, there you go. I was looking for a big mushroom. Oh, 
all the doors in this place? Hey, there's a door. Still during the procedure, they can be bound around the circumference or simply oh, stretched goodness. across, tying limbs to the spokes and rim. All tools are by this point useful, and you may administer the torture in any way you like. But the forte of the wheel is the gaps. When you have decided that the victim shall die, you can smash their limbs with a hammer, making them fold in between the frame. But they'll Die too quickly, I mean. No, I don't, don't know. worry. Possibly the, the human body is much more resilient. They can survive for days until they finally succumb. Possibly not to kill, but this has already happened. This is in our head. This has already technically happened to us. There's a piece of orb. Let's do this. The murderer's limbs were tied to the spokes of the wheel. They turned the wheel slowly, but with the intent of the rope secured around those stretched and cracked the bone. Uh, he could no longer have the strength to scream. The two men looked at each other knowing it and took a hammer and struck the victim's chest in a final act of mercy. So yeah, I must have missed a orb in that chamber over there. There's a monster in here, I know that much for sure. I'm just hoping not to see it. Or if I do see it, I am be able to, you know, run. Oh, I can't get up. Oh, there's the monster. Time to run, chat. We knew there was a monster. Ow! Hey! Don't hit me. I'm a fragile little being. in here. Oh, that's messed up. I don't like the bugs. I really don't like those bugs. That's messed up. I don't want friends. I think I hear the orb. Oh, there it is. It's that red glow. Okay. Cool. Alright, before we head back out into that, that fun-filled room... in the right place. It's in this room. It's not in the entrance. It's in this room. And we need to find one more torture chamber because, you know, all this stuff is from the tortures. How's my health? A few cuts and bruises.
Well, that's just somewhere. I think I'm being chased again, chat. Is there a door back here? There is. Yeah, there's a mushroom we need. Close that. Ooh, that's not a fun torture. The trainer did not know what to think of the brass bull as he was forced to enter it. Only when the heat of fire began to scorch his skin and cook his flesh did he realize it was his tomb. His screams of pain echoed inside the brass chamber and traveled through the complex instrument, which was the bull's head, out to the men could hear the brazen bull bellow. That's what I need. All right, sandy wise, we're we're gotten better. All right. I am looking up one more thing. So I'm actually looking for something. figure it out. Either way, we need to open this door, pull this, poison gland, all right, and now we run. We try to leave. I think we're done with the choir. Here, I'm gonna call that man George. He's faster and much more horrifying, so he's a George. Oh, I don't know where I need to leave. Oh, this way. Hey, there's the door. Bye, George. Ah, he left George. We got all the pieces though for the orb. But I want to free Agrippa. I like him. He's a friend. Don't worry, Agrippa, we're gonna try. So how do we do this? I have no idea how do we get this. I'm actually gonna look up how to get the tamper. Tempter.
There it is. Let's see. The rope needs to be pulled up before anything can be attached to it. So how do I pull it up? This is actually being a bit interesting because I'm not getting a good answer, to be honest. How to pull rope. I'm not getting any answers with this. This is actually working. Hold on. Oh, wait. <laughs> Chat, uh, I'm a gray A idiot. I didn't know the thing was attached inside. Thank you. There we go. Remains. So next would be to get to the laboratory, I believe. Okay. I see that all the art pieces you need. So from what I gathered, what I have to do is go this way. Uh reach once more for the empty bottle of laudanum and first choice best to get the bed post. Alright. We're working our way through the game. Spooky. Oh, hi. All right. Sleep. 
Uh, I have the eternal sleep. Yeah, I'm dead. All right, maybe I don't open that door. He just went all summer in bed. He used to read to her after helping father with his work. In his mind, he was like Sisrazi. And as long as he kept telling the story, she would not die. Ooh. Oh, hi. I'm in jail now. All right. It does explain so much of your behavior. You never did finish what you set out to do. You talked about redemption, how you would face the orb's shadow and save our work and me. I will grant you another chance to redeem yourself. You can wait here and stop the shadow. Thank you, friend. Uh, let's see, Mentos. Find a way out, huh? Uh, I guess I've got a lot, so... This is of no use. Oh, I can grab some now. So we're now trapped in a room. This is the new playthrough, is us trying to leave the room. But I have a pipe. No use. No use. Nothing pry out this part of the wall. Ooh, okay. Ooh, not good. Oh. Freedom. And this. There's little left to say. I write solely to prevent myself from revisiting the memories of these past few days. If I am fortunate, I will fall asleep and the time will pass without effort. I've begun to wean myself on my poison. When I first arrived, I felt like I was being buried inside a tomb, and now I feel the closed walls comforting me. As long as I am here, there is no pain. The walls protect me from the outside. I even laughed earlier as one of my wardens dropped a key down the pipes. It gave me hope for a second, thinking I could escape if I could somehow reach it from here. 
In my dreams, Alexander, I am king. In my dreams, I best you and escape your clutches and return with all the knights of the realm, carrying pistols and sabers in my dreams. Let's see if this works. Oh, wait, maybe the other way. There we go. Alright, something can be there. Wait, oh. What the? Hi, dude. I'm getting nightmares again. It's always fun. It's in here. A bucket. Oh, a bucket. Crush his skull. He deserves it. Crush his skull. He deserves it. Uh, fun. All right. All right. We lower this back down. Now we lower bring this back up. Let's see if we can do this. Bucket of water. Bucket of water. It's locked. Oh, one of the pipes, right? Notes. Last prisoner note. Uh, let's see. As he dropped a key down the pipes. Over here. Ah. There we go. Mm, let's take some laudanum to at least increase my main health. I'm free. No, we're not looking. Lock that door, that's very mean of me. I am being chased beyond the way. Try to fix this disaster, and yet you keep trying to stop me and murder me. So let me fix this. I just need more time, shit. Hey! When he was turned 15, she lived three hours longer than the doctor Tate had foreseen. Her parents had given up from exhaustion and decided to have her committed for permanent treatment at Canterbury Hospice. But she was still alive. She had embraced him and wished him to grant adventure in Algeria. Oh, a note. Uh oh, no. Oh god. No. No, don't wake up. Don't take. No, I'm so close. As with Kisai, he can no longer what to say. He can no longer recognize his friend sitting across the carriage. 18th of August, 1839. Tonight, you will unlock the power of the orb and ultimately banish the shadow hunting me. I feel it closing in on me and I fear for my life more than ever. Just outside Goldstadt lies a small settlement where Zimmerman dairy farm lives with his wife and three children. What are we doing? Took the coach, went there. Our visit 
was unexpected, and Alexander was able to strike Zimmerman down without alerting the other. Oh, dear lord. He went to take care of the farmhands. I began to look for the children. We should have more than enough prisoners to finish the ritual now. So Daniel is bad guy. We have full confirmed this. Daniel is purely the bad guy. Yeah, I believe this is the way. Oh, never mind, it's not the way. Oh, can't go that way. Ow. in here. I can't light any of these torches, Chad. Ouch. Ooh, hey. Alright, one, we're a bit safer in here, at least. We're just going to put that there. box all right incomplete tonic yeah uh, so maybe this and I would think maybe the poison kind he and the glad will not attract. Oh, okay, so then it must be the tempter. Yeah. Oh, there we go. And then we we are going to just squeeze the grind. Tonic, hey, we can now help Agrippa. The castle trembled, and I could hear the chancel collapse. The laboratory might be accessible now. Hey, have this. You're free, my dude. Quickly, off with the head. And then, what that happens, get me through that gate. I supposed to do? Off with your good boy, and I appreciate you coming. But I believe you have more important things to take care of. Can't get any closer, so I guess I did it. I turned angry. It was easy to take her insolence and make her the villain of the story, but she didn't deserve to die. Even he could see that. Me a monster. Alright. 
appropriate workspace, huh? I thought that was the appropriate workspace, but I guess it's over here. Nope. Or yes. Chat, that's the wrong way. So let's try it over here. the orb and rebuild the amnesia. Oh, not yet. Not yet. supposed to do now? Oh, I have to touch it. Nope. What am I supposed to do then? I guess I'll go the other way and check around. I must be missing something, chat. Also, is this monster still in here? Jim or something. Boulder would be big enough. Let's sit in that corner. What? The machine is broken. Hey, I said, oh god. We got something not good. I 
don't have any laudanum. I'm wounded. We disappeared, Chad. No, we did not. Oh, God, hi. To try chat. Go. There it is, chat. Inner sanctum. I saw that the enemy had taken a toll on his friend's mind and barred him from the inner sanctum. He could no longer be trusted to be part of the ritual. Well, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna be a part of this. Ritual. by that demon. He played my guilty conscience and duped me into facing the shadow alone. That vile, conspiring man. He expects me to meet my death as he steals power beyond imagination. Alexander, I will kill you for what you have done. If only the shadow had caught me in London or Algeria, I wouldn't have to suffer this humiliation. You made me a murderer. A monster! And now, I merely await my death. I am too weak to press on. I can hardly stand as my knees fail me. I cannot see as my eyes are dressed in tears. I am as broken as the men I've tortured. If only I could wipe my fear away, as we did with them. I put something in that. Not open. I think I can take the bleed. There we go. Search for a way to open it. Hmm. Oh, I had a stand on it. Got it. Well, I already, but I already put, gave my blood to this one. There we go. Yeah. I can't. 
can't move. Ouch. All right, here we go. The orb chamber. If it wasn't for Alexander, he would still be innocent and be able to die so. It saddens me to see you filled with such hate. Is vengeance really what you seek? I hoped you, of all people, could appreciate the grave nature of the situation. After all, it's always been your life we were fighting for. Isn't it worth a little sacrifice? Come, help me finish the ritual. There's still time before the shadow catches up with you. No, don't do that. Uh. I realize you doubt my intentions. Why would I take such extreme measures to save your life? You are ruining it. I really don't care. You are so close, I beg you. If you made me a monster, we're gonna be monsters together. You killed us. You killed us both. Survivor. Kill Alexander and escape the castle. Amnesia the Dark Descent. triumph and I never looked back you think I was afraid fleeing Brennenberg huh. quite the contrary Oop. I knew it was my purgatory hellfire made to wash away my sins. Can't get through. There's no denying the things I've done, but I have paid my tribute. I gave them that awful man. I did the right thing. Hey, chat, we did the right thing. Dark Descent. I understand why this thing is a genre-defying scary game. It was very fun. I wasn't. It was still spooky. It, I didn't jump and scream at certain moments, but for just for the most part, for the most part, my heart has been pumping throughout. The just knowing what could be liking behind the kerners and things like this. The suspense of the game with the little spooks here and there really put me into like a fearful state so thank you guys for not playing any booze on me because or that because probably would have scared me but we did we beat the game and I do want to since we beat the game I do want to announce the surprise um, although I'm gonna stop, uh, I'm streaming Friday, and that'll be my last Friday stream, I will be streaming tomorrow. Uh, Phasmophobia's update is coming out, and I have talked with Galloping Clown, my, uh, one of my friends, and we are planning on streaming, uh, Phasmophobia, uh, with a new update tomorrow. So, get, look forward to that. We are planning on doing some more Phasmophobia. Brand new Phasmophobia. I will no longer be level 300 with my $20,000. I'll be down to level 0 with $0. We have done it, chat. The end. Now there's one more achievement I would like to get in this game. It's a very simple achievement. Start new game normal yes 
So, would you like to know? I'm not done yet. we got one more achievement we got to get. This achievement is something I've been wanting to do. So we need to go back to the beginning, chat. Don't forget. Some things must be forgotten. The shadow hunting me. I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at... at... Uh, Mayfair. What have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is... is... I am Daniel. It's a very simple, Jim. I think everyone would get a kick out of it. Well, chat, we've been here before, haven't we? Alright, here we go. We're up on the ground now. We're up off the ground. We're just gonna pick stuff up and keep moving. Because the achievement is actually very quickly done. It's a very quick achievement, but it's one of my favorite. It's an achievement that I did not know about until I watched someone else play it, and I think it's hilarious. Alright. We go this way. We. I think we open this. Go through here. Grab that. Move on. Follow the blood stains for a little bit. Alright. We're getting there, chat. See it's almost there. Now here, we pause and save an exit. Nope! <laughs> Left the game when things were getting interesting in Amnesia the Dark Descent. <laughs> that was the final achievement I wanted to do. With that being said, that will end the stream off. Thank you everyone for watching uh, Amnesia. Uh, that was a fun game. It was very fun. Um, I think we'll find a different game, not a spooky game. We'll take a break from the spooks. Because uh, I do have another game, Spooky, that I do want to play that's coming down the future. But I think we should lay off the spooks. We'll find another non-spooky game um, to play. Uh, with that being said, I hope to catch everyone tomorrow. There's a good th should chance we'll... Um, at least I'll be playing Phasmophobia. Maybe Galloping Clown. There's a good chance we talked about it. But don't worry. Tomorrow we'll, we'll be doing the Phasmophobia stream. I have said that as soon as the update happens, we're I'm doing a Phasma stream and... You know what, guys, you're lucky. Uh, I may not be able to do three streams on Monday. I may not be able to stream on Monday, but you're getting a three-stream week still because I'm streaming tomorrow. It will be a late uh, evening stream, though, roughly around the 7 of uh, my time. Uh, with that being said, I hope to catch everyone later. You stay safe out there, and you know what? I'm going to say it. Um, take a break. Go take a break. Play your favorite game. You've been working too hard, and I'll catch you all later.